Hi everybody and welcome to Daily Scuba News. Two scuba divers in the waters off Hawaii had a rude awakening September last year when they surfaced from their dive and their dive boat was just gone. Now this is normally a very bad day for divers but for this couple it turned out to be an even worse day when they found out where their boat had gone. Their dive boat had been intercepted by officers from the Division of Conservatism and Resources Enforcement for illegal collection of fish for aquaria. Now, Stephen Howard and Yukako Toriyama are facing a record $272,000 fine for poaching after a unanimous vote from Hawaii's Board of Land and Natural Resources. Howard, who is described as an aquarium collector, left the the harbour and dropped his wife and an unnamed female dive buddy in the water to collect fish on that day. The officers then intercepted the boat after an anonymous tip and ordered Howard to return the ship to shore, which he did, and left his divers in the water. The two divers, they did make it back to Kona by themselves safely and a multi-agency search that was looking for them was called off when they were found safe and sound at a filling station on dry land. Biologists from NOAA, or sorry, NOAA's Office of Law Enforcement um, and Hawaii's Division of Aquatic Resources found that there were already 235 fish on board the boat that Howard was driving when it was intercepted from 10 different species with an estimated retail value somewhere in the region of $25,000, all of which were returned to the sea. Howard was fined for 16 different fishing and boating violations and Toriyama uh, 9 Hawaii administrative rules. So hopefully this will be enough of a deterrence for others thinking about doing the same thing and hopefully these two will find a better, more you know, legal way to make money in the future and hopefully this isn't just going to push their illegal activities like under the radar. Um, but yeah, don't don't go scuba diving and poach fish. It's it's never a good thing, and it's certainly not worth it because these guys are really making it obvious that it, crime doesn't pay. Thank you for watching, and of course, safe diving.